Darren again with Well Waterboy Products. Uh, back last year when I began this project about coming up with the um, impossible hand pump, a better hand pump, I sought the advice of um, uh, pump installers and windmill professionals and I told them what I was doing and they told me that um, what I am trying to do is basically impossible but after 150 years of, of uh, building hand pumps and uh, windmills that the best combination would have already been done and they told me that I would never be able to pull up on that rod. In a way, I do understand what they were saying that I wouldn't be able to come and pull up on that rod because um, uh, they were saying that, uh, that a four inch cylinder at 80 foot, there's a lot of enormous pressure on the inside of them, uh, inside that chamber on them seals. When you go to pull up on it, it takes a lot of mechanical advantage. So I decided to see what the load would be with a, a six to one block and tackle. This is the load, and this is the effort. Right now I have 135 pounds, and so 135 times 6 would be 810 pounds. Now we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So what I'm going to attempt to do here is, um, is show you what it takes to pull up on this rod. Now when I release this weight, The line is going to stretch first before it starts pulling up on that rod. So it's just barely balancing right now. So that's 810 pounds. To get it to drop the rest of the way, I just put a five pound weight on it, <laughs> and there it goes, slowly but surely. As you can see, I got three 45 pound weights and one five pound weight. That's 840 pounds. I'm pulling up a 16 inch stroke in under three seconds. That's 850 pounds, 840 pounds. On the short stroke, it'll pull up several more hundred pounds. Now, I'm getting prepared to install uh, my new drop pipe and sucker rod. A sucker rod that comes with the water buck pump is three-quarter fiberglass rod, professional connectors on the ends, real easy to put together, and comes with the rod guides. I will be installing um, this with two-inch galvanized pipe, 130 feet. And uh, we're going to use a, a four to one block and tackle instead of a six to one. And I'll use it with my windlass to raise and lower um, and to install the pump. Stay tuned.